What are jinns? Jinn are creatures made by Allah that cannot be seen by the human eye. They were created before the first of mankind. Jinn were created for the same purpose as mankind, and that is to worship Allah and follow his messengers. The jinn that do not believe and misguide are the ones referred to as shayateen or devils. There are also human shayateen as their goals align with the evil jinn. Allah has given the knowledge to understand them through the Quran and the Sunnah. In folklore they are sometimes referred to as genies, but they are very real. Unlike the idea of ghosts or spirits of the dead, these creatures are a separate entity just like how Allah has created cats, dogs, birds and other species. It's just that they are more unique and have a similar purpose in life to humans. Likewise, since jinn have free will, they will be put on trial for their actions on the Day of Judgment. Along with humans, Allah created them from a smokeless flame of fire. This flame is different from the usual fire that humans utilize in their regular living. It's similar to how Allah created humans from dirt, but we are not the same as the dirt on the ground, but share the same properties. The materials that Allah used are a different type of fire or dirt that only He has access to. When Allah first made Adam and breathed life into him, Allah asked all present to prostrate before Adam. The parties that were present were all the angels and a jinn named Iblis. Iblis worshipped Allah regularly and was elevated due to his devotion. Everyone prostrated except Iblis. He believed that he was better than Adam because he was made of fire while Adam was made out of earth. This earned him the wrath of Allah and he was cursed till the end of time. He now has the title of Shaitan, the one whose primary goal is to lead mankind astray. Allah gave him extra abilities and power to test mankind with. Iblis isn't the only jinn, and there are many other jinns as well. They are all made out of the same flame, but they have differing abilities. They can fly, move extremely fast, and transform into other creatures. Jinn are awfully weak creatures when proper actions are taken. First and foremost, seeking refuge with Allah whenever a situation does not feel right. Allah is the creator of jinn and has put mankind as a creation above them. The one who created all things can easily protect anyone from any creature, let alone a jinn. May Allah guide and protect us.